so after installing Node.js, we are going to create a new folder to store the React app. So here's under the drive D, I'm going to create a new folder called React. So this is another folder, React Native, is a uh, different projects. And this one is a mobile application. So we are going to create a web uh, for the web app. So this just call it as a React. So this is the GitHub for the React to create a React app. And when we scroll down, we can actually see there are three ways to uh, install an app. So this is using the NPX and NPM and also Yon. So what I'm going to do is that I'm going to use this command. This is uh, the one that I normally do and I prefer to use this as well. All right, so now let's open CMD or command prompt. Right click on that. Click um, select the run as administrator. So we just created the folder name uh, called react. So in order to navigate to try D, um, we can just D colon and then CD react. So this means that we are inside the react folder. So let's do, we are going to do next is to uh, type this command cmd init react app and call the folder name. Uh, I would call it as react.js. Right now it's going to download all of the package and all the required dependencies and extra. And after this finish, I'm going to show you the folder that it's actually contain all those information. I'm going to also open it with the code editor so that we can actually edit some things and show it on the website. All right, so now all of these packages uh, have been installed onto that uh, folder. And now let me navigate to that folder and see what's inside that folder. So it's uh, React. So this is the folder called React.js. Uh, and I'm going to open it with the code editor. Visual Studio Code. Open the folder. It's inside this SRC stand for source. So now we are inside the React folder. Um, right now I'm going to navigate to React.js projects. Now we can actually type NMP start to start this application. And it's going to open up the browser and then uh, see what can be changed based on that. Okay, so now the application is already running. So for this block, I'm going to change width. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Click on save and then this will refresh. So you can see the text is actually changed. Um, says welcome to my channel. So this is the first tutorial on uh, how to install React JS or React on the device. So in this case, this is Windows. See you guys in next video.